so today I have an exciting video for y'all. I was scrolling through Facebook the other day and saw this video of this product being demoed and I thought it was super super cool and kind of gimmicky which are kind of my favorite kind of products and I thought it'd be either very very good and very convenient or this might be a total disaster. So obviously I bought it. They are the Mystic Cotton Swab Lip Tints. They are from Korea. I got the shade red and they're literally just like q-tips with lip tint inside the stick and you're supposed to kind of like snap it or something then the lip tint will go into the cotton bud and you put it on your lips so the whole idea is that you just need to throw like one of these into your purse takes up no space and it's super super like convenient so I got the shade red because that's what the girl I think was using on the video and it looked really really pretty and I don't know this just seems really like a wild and crazy to me I've never seen anything like it so I really want to try it out so if you like the style video I don't even know like what you call it just testing out weird beauty stuff got a video let me know in the comments down below or just like the video and also don't forget to subscribe I upload twice a week on Sundays and Wednesdays and I would love it if you guys would stick around but without further ado let's try these things out alright so I moved up a little closer so you can really see what's going on but this is I guess a close-up of the packaging and of the products themselves you get 20 in here which I think is a lot it cost me I think $11 um, so it was very very affordable and then there's instructions off the back most of it's in Korean but there's a little bit in English and then a little demo so basically what you're supposed to do is twist off this little plastic bit and then pull it and this stuff is supposed to go into this side I believe and then you just apply it as you usually would if you applied lip products with a q-tip um, so yeah, let's give this a try. So you're just supposed to twist the little plastic bit, which I don't think is actually like doing anything. I feel like it's just going in circles, which had like a grippy or something on it. I'm try and do it. Okay, there we go. Okay, so I use a t-shirt to like grab onto the bottom of this to twist it and that worked. So then you twist it and just pull it off. Oh, 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 oh. Okay, got too excited, got lip tint on my phone and on my clean shirt, but luckily not on my white shirt, so that's good. And all of the lip tint went to the Q-tip, and it didn't really like fully saturate it, but it got the tip. And then from here, you're just supposed to put it on your lips. And this is what my lips look like after application, and I'm actually pleasantly surprised. I was worried about the like cotton ball applicator that I was going to kind of, I don't know, absorb too much product and there wouldn't be enough for my full lips, or it's going to make it like streaky, or I was going to get like cotton all over my mouth, or like something not cute. The stain itself is actually very, very comfortable. It doesn't feel like I'm wearing anything, but there's definitely color there, as you can see. And I'm really liking the color itself. Again, I got the color red. I want to say that they had like three or four other colors I'll link everything down below but the red's very very pretty it just looks like you've been sucking on a lollipop all day or something and I think it's really pretty my only con that I've come up with so far is that this is a little messy um, I got a little bit on my phone I got it on a shirt I almost got it on my white desk which would have been bad I mean you definitely need to throw this away immediately after you're done using it you don't want to just set it down somewhere because it will probably stain it it, which is no good but overall I'm very impressed with this I think the concept is really really cool I like the idea that you just need to take like one of these in your purse and it takes up literally the amount of space a q-tip would take up and I like that it's comfortable and looks very natural even though it's like a red it still doesn't look like you're wearing like a big bold red lipstick if you know what I mean okay so it's currently about two in the afternoon and I think it'd be fun to see how this product wears for a couple of hours to see if it really does kind of like stain your lips so I'm gonna check back and see how it wears. So I will see you guys in a few hours. Hey y'all, so it's been about five hours since I last checked in and I've been busy. I've done some cleaning, I took a nap, I ate some lunch, and I took Bentley on a walk. So, you know, I've been doing some things on my day off and I think the lip tint has lasted pretty well. Looking up close, I definitely think the actual like pigmentation of it has faded a little bit but it's still like colors on your lips and it faded very evenly so it looks really good and it feels like you're wearing nothing. Um, I've applied like Burt's Bees chopstick on top and it was perfectly fine. Nothing like transferred or anything and it's just very comfortable and it's kind of like 
a lip color you don't have to worry about, which I really like. And I like that it's lasted so long. I can definitely see this lasting for me like a whole work day. And it's just so nice not to have to like worry about reapplying your lip color because it's already kind of like stained on. And I like the portability aspect of this where you can just kind of like grab one of these, put it in your purse, and then apply it before you go out for drinks or something if you're going out you know, after work or whatever your schedule is like. Um, it's just so like small and compact and easy and then after you apply it you don't have to worry about you know reapplying it after you've had a drink and some food because it stayed on. Um, I had like Spanish rice for lunch and uh, obviously drank like water and it stayed on for that. There was no transfer and honestly I'm just pleasantly surprised with these little cotton swab lip tints. I also really like the color I got. I think it's really pretty for summer and they have like a cherry red that's a little bit deeper that I think would be really pretty for like winter so I might end up getting that because uh, these are actually really really cool the only thing you have to be careful of is that it can get a little messy once you actually take the little plastic bit off and then the tint goes down in here you don't want to drop it because you'd lose product and you can stain like your clothes or your furniture or whatever you're using um, and we don't want to do that. But other than that, it's very user friendly. It goes on super nice, super comfortable. Honestly, that's really my only complaint about it. Everything else is really good. I'll leave a link down below where you can find it. I'm pretty sure I found mine on like eBay, um, but it was totally legit, so that's good. If you want to see any more of these like testing weird beauty product kind of videos, let me know what you want to see tested in the comments so I can get it and put it to the test for you guys. But yeah, that is everything for today, and I will see you guys later. Bye, y'all.